ki khubor ka bate si tv lawan rashafi ta ka frank motors kamon ban long slur ringkat bat ka man ba shongkhia ka shong ha ka jinglong skem bat jingjit ba start jongi ka tata haria ka kali ka ban san ya ka linti ya jongpi ka la ban long ka jongpi minta book ya ka tata haria ha frank motors lat korni leni phone ha number hnyo not sau san ar not hnyo khanda hnyo lai Ketenat kekoi kekia atau kejelah minta kesengi kela pelong ya ke health advisory committee ya ke bala peniak tu buat meral bonds aim u bedew MLA jong ke dong pok benya tai halo ke bubun ke binta baik ke dekot jong ke buat. Habis keren baik ke lapa tai ke buat ke doktor mezel ampering ling do ke bedew ke menteri sorkar bepe ya ketenat kekoi kekia baik ke lapin pao 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 baik Syu-syu ke Menteri Sorkar ke luang hapa pek ya ke jingkiu stet, jeng ke biyo ya ke jingpang niang kuliah hapa ke jelah meghalaya, bala dan ngimmi syak hamad banyak keren ya ke nikah mat hapa syed bat hapa syai, ngi terai ngi hap ban syem ya ke jingkit kli ya ke ee badan kam ban le. The Health Advisory Committee is chaired by our Honorable MLA of Nongko, Mr. Meryl Bones A. And uh, we had a brief consult with the board and we thought that it would be in the fitness of things to ensure that while creating these boards which have been for so long alleged to be mere political appointments, we thought that we would go out of this <coughs> common practice or common belief and assign certain uh, certain assignments to the board and i was happy to have had a detailed uh, discussion with them wherein i have requested them to uh, get into a project that would be looking at commercial sex workers and what is the kind of advisory that this health advisory board could give to the health department so that we can ensure that we take positive steps towards the discussion of commercial sex workers. What should we do for this, this group of citizens? What are the things that we need to look at? What are the challenges? What is happening in you know, the debate about commercial sex workers? looking at the dynamics of the increase, the proportionate increase that we see in uh, HIV AIDS in the state of Meghalaya. If we do not sit down, bring to the open and discuss this agenda, I think we would be shying away from that responsibility of actually looking at what needs to get done to ensure that citizens are safe citizens um, citizens are advised citizens are monitored irrespective of the kind of engagements that they have in their everyday lives this is one area which the health advisory committee will now look at and i hope that we will be able to gain necessary inputs from these kinds of boards and these kinds of committees so that government can take necessary decisions that would avert an otherwise explosive situation in several um, implications in the health sector. Uh, the chairperson of the, the chairman of the board also thought that it would be in the fitness of things to allow them to study and to allow them to engage with experts to discuss the matter of uh, traditional medicines, traditional healing, traditional, uh, you know, traditional practices that are anyways very popular in communities across the state of Meghalaya. We have seen that uh, there is great potential in some of the medicines or the medicinal practices that are there 
in this sector of work we've seen that we are now hand holding traditional healers through various government of india schemes they're getting the adequate attention the adequate financial inputs to help us look at a possibility of our traditional medicines that can may as well get popular and gain importance in in the entire spectrum of 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 traditional healing systems